Um, I was not raised in a church, and so uh, when I became a Christian a few years ago, I learned very quickly that I had a lot of questions that weren't going to be answered on Sunday mornings. And Sunday mornings were great, and they got me energized for the week, and they uh, really left me with some good messages to think about, but I had so much more that I wanted to cover and so much of Scripture that I wanted to delve into that I didn't want to wait for once a week. I found that one of the best ways to really get into some of those difficult questions is through being a part of a small group. Um, when my husband and I joined Journey, we really looked around for a group that would uh, fit our needs and realized very quickly that there was not a small group that was meeting on our end of Roanoke for young families. So we just kind of um, decided to start our own. We've been able to uh, get together about five couples typically, all with small children who are um, really just all looking to come together and answer some difficult questions and um, delve into some things that aren't always easy to talk about, into the doubts that we all have as Christians, into the struggles that we run into, into the sin that comes into our lives, um, into the struggles between being a Christian and also existing in the outside world. Um, so it's really a place where we can come together without any fear of being judged, without worrying about saying the wrong thing or asking a dumb question. Um, we can just kind of come and uh, sometimes debate things that are a little difficult. Uh, occasionally we disagree on what the scripture might say or what it might mean, um, but ultimately at the end of the day we have really strong relationships that allow us to get into these questions uh, and come out with something very meaningful um, and something that's ultimately going to strengthen our relationship with God and our relationships with each other.